Okay, so today we're gonna go over a dumbbell concentration curl. This is a very old school exercise. You see most guys doing this in their workouts, during their arm workouts. It's a very simple exercise, but it's very easy to get wrong. Now, with this, again, you're gonna, your focus here is to work that bicep through its full range of motion, really get some blood into it, good concentrated curls. Now, you're gonna choose a weight that you're very comfortable with, that you don't have to cheat the exercise with, so you don't have to rock your body or anything. You can stay real firm and real concentrated. That's why it's called a concentration curl. With this exercise, you're gonna keep your, your wrist up to the sky, palms to the sky, supinated the whole time. Now, as you come up, you see a lot of guys, you don't know what to do with their wrist. As a rule, when you come up, if you try to squeeze so that your pinkies rotate up, it'll actually peak out the bicep a little more. So guys always talk about they want that peak in their bicep. Well, what you do is you rotate so that your pinky goes up and your thumb goes down. That really contracts that muscle to its fullest. So during a concentration curl, that's exactly what you want to try to do. Notice I'm rotating the dumbbell so that my pinky comes up. Now, it's also important to breathe during this exercise. Anytime you work against gravity is when you want to breathe out. So I'm bringing it up, working against gravity. Breathe out, really squeeze that muscle, concentrate that muscle, release, come down slow. Never ever do you want to jerk up and drop it. It's not going to do anything for that muscle. It's not going to do anything for your results. Best results are when you concentrate. Up, squeeze, down, release. Squeeze, down, release. Now if size is your goal, then you want to shoot for 10 to 15 reps, maybe eight, but 12 is really the standard. So after you perform 12 with one arm, obviously you want to switch to the other. You're going to support your elbow with your leg here. You never want to lock out your elbow completely because that'll do damage to that joint. So you're always going to keep a slight bend in your elbow. Same thing as the other arm. Come up, squeeze, try to rotate your pinky a little tiny bit up, really peek out your bicep. Come back down, controlled. Breathe out, squeeze, inhale. And that's your concentration, girl. Thank you.